Hello, Assalamualaikum guys and welcome back to our new tutorial. It's Ibrahim Muslim and today I'm going to show you how to get USB 3.0 working on your Hackintosh with OS X 10.12 Mac OS X Serra. So right now you can see that my Mac OS X Serra is working properly with NVIDIA Graphic Card. We will open system report and we'll move to USB. Down here we will check that my ADATA USB flash drive is working at a speed of 5 gigabytes per second which is the latest speed for a USB 3.0 drive. Now we will open our Blackmagic test and here we will check our drive speed. As it is just a normal USB 3.0 drive, the write speeds are not so good but you can get the estimate from the read speed that this thing is working on USB 3.0. We'll run the speed test. The write speed is about 8 MBs which is not legit due to the software difference of this Blackmagic Dix speed test but you can see the read speed is about 120 megabyte and we can check we we'll verify one more time let it reload this now you can see it's like 121.4 now we will close the test and we will see how I got this thing working the first thing you have to do is you have to open your multi beast 9.0 which is designed for Mac OS X era you have to open this you have to go to drivers USB and you have to install both of these install increase max port limit and 789 series USB port you have to install it I'm not going to install it because I'm using a USB recorder and if I reinstall it that might stop working so once you install it you have to mount your EFI drive using clever configurator if you don't know how to mount it you can check my other video but once mounted you have to open your config.plst once the config.plst is loaded, you have to go in kernels and cax patches and you have to add this little patch here with the name of Apple USB XHCI PCI and you have to write this fine hacks and replace with this hacks and you can just write any comment which can make it easy to remember what this patch is for. Once you have added this patch, you just have to save your config.plst and you have to open your EFI. You will open your EFI folder in the EFI drive and then move to the Clover. Once in the Clover you have to move to the text and you have to move into 10.12. I will zoom it. Once you are into in the 10.12 folder in the Clover text, you have to copy these two files fake PCI ID and fake PCI ID dot text and USB inject all text here from your OS X drive where you will find these cache is after installing from the multi beach you will get these text placed in your OS X library extension and here you will get these text replaced this one fake PCI ID this one and the one one at the bottom these three you just have to copy them and you have to Go to your EFI folder, EFI, Clover, CAX, 10.12 and just you have to place them. I already have placed them so I will just skip, I will just skip the ones I have already placed. So once done, you can just close it, close it and you can just recheck your config.plst if the kernel and CAX patches are written. If you find this thing written, that's all you need to do for the USB 3.0 on Mac OS X Sierra. After this, you can just restart the computer with some prayers and hope that will work out. So that's all for this video guys. Thanks for watching. Hope you like it. Hope this helped you out. For more such videos, please subscribe, share and like. If you have any question, please feel free to ask below. I'm always here to help you out. That's all for this video. So until the very next video guys, please take care, Allah Hafiz.